Hi, this is Patrick from STH. If you're a Windows IT admin, you've had at least one lustful moment over the years where you've seen an Apple OS X user fire up an SSH session directly from the terminal instead of using a tool like PuTTY. Microsoft has been reinventing itself and has new features that have rightfully garnered lots of attention like Windows Subsystem for Linux. One other under the radar change is that Microsoft now has an open SSH client and server available directly at the command prompt. If all you need is a simple OpenSSH connection, this is the answer. In this video, we're gonna show how to install the OpenSSH client in Windows 10. First, go to the Start menu and type Manage Optional Features, or you can navigate there from the Apps and Features Settings page. You're gonna click Add a Feature, and then buried in this list of supplemental fonts, you'll see an OpenSSH client and OpenSSH server app and we're gonna install the client now, which has a beta tag at present. Within a few seconds, it should be installed. And now you can fire up a standard command prompt and use the SSH command as you normally would. We're gonna to connect to Deep Learning 11, our 10 GPU deep learning training server. And that's it. Even though it is buried in a list of supplemental fonts, you can now do things like create shortcuts to open SSH sessions, and save them on your desktop without a strange syntax. We hope Microsoft quickly moves this feature out of beta as it's really cool. Thank you for watching. Take some time to visit the STH main site, check out other videos we have, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.